This is Angela Palladis, and I like reading books. Welcome to Five Minutes with Dad, starring Pavlos and Angela Pavlidis, where you get to spend a few minutes with the smartest and coolest kids in the whole world, and their dad, too. And now, here are your hosts, Pavlos, Angela, and Nick Pavlidis. Who's ready for the office episode? Five Minutes with Dad! Woo! Me! Okay, then let's get on with the show. Hey, what am I, a can of corn? Woo, woo, woo. All right, yeah. so Pavlos has a pet dog, but the pet dog is not going to be on the show, right? Roo. <laughs> yes. So today we have something really important to talk about because we just did an episode. Sometimes we record two at a time or whatever. And the last one we recorded was on how to be kind to classmates. We talked about different ways. And that might not be the one that we're going to put right away because sometimes when we have a lot of Pavlos episodes and a lot of Angela episodes recorded and then episodes with both of them, we switch around. So we don't just do a whole month of Pavlos, right? Or do you want a month of Pavlos, Pavlos? Month of Pavlos! Month of Pavlos! Month of Pavlos! <laughs> All right, Pavlos. No. So usually we switch them up. So we mix everything up. But... We did an episode on how to be kind to our classmates, and it was based on a rule that Pavlos' classroom has, but the other half of that rule is what, Pavlos? Um, classmates in community. Yes, so how to be kind to classmates and your community. So today we're going to talk about ways not to today. be not today. We're going to be kind today. We're going to talk about how to be kind to our communities. But before we do, Pavlos, do you want to introduce the resource of the week? Mario Monopoly. Yes. So Mario Monopoly. Pavlos loves Monopoly. I recommend this game. It's a 100 star review from me. <laughs> Where'd you come up with that? All right. So Pavlos, you got the Pavlos seal of approval for Mario Monopoly. If you go to 5minutewithdad.com slash Mario, that's our affiliate link to send you over to Amazon to pick up a game right go ahead Bob. so the game is about how like there's instead of dollars there's coins the highest you can get is five <coughs> coins which would be five dollars and then there's single coins and and you um buy little properties and um we just got a guest here um angela say hello Hi. and um so, like, once you get around the board, you get two coins, plus you get to battle a boss. And there's this special dice that gives you powers. So, let's say I get a red shell. I get to use the red shell on someone, so they drop their coins. And um, the Yoshi and Mario, Donkey Kong, and Peach, uh, they all have powers to battle. Like, let's say Yoshi lands on the star. He will collect all the coins on the board. Let and Peach will just... Peach has powers, too. I forgot Peach's powers. Donkey, Mario's power, if he lands on a star, he gets three coins. Powers. Angela, tell them Peach's powers. So, one's a red shell, one's a star, and then I forget the other one. So, her, she gets a star, a red shell, and Angela's checking for the third one. Y you can either get um a ghost which takes away coins, or two shells that drop coins. Mario, it, his, his, star, his star attack is roll the number dice, collect that many coins, five from the bank. Five, you get five extra from the bank. All right. Well, as you can tell, we're going to have five. We have five minutes with Mario at this point. But yeah, Pavlos Mario. loves the Mario game. So the Mario Monopoly, if you like, if you you or your kids like Mario Brothers, it's a fun way to play Monopoly. And Pavlos and Angela love it. So if you want to pick up a copy, you go to 5minuteswithdad.com slash Mario. That's our affiliate link to send you right over to Amazon to pick up a set. Could be a great Hanukkah or Christmas present, right? Yeah, I'm going to be right. All right, so Pavlos has taken a run. Angela, Angela just joined us. We're talking, this is early in the morning, and Angela just came down. Ange, you want to come and say good morning to everybody or hello? Hello. Hello, Angela. We're talking about ways 
Yeah, yeah, we're talking about ways to be kind in your community. Do you know, we, one of the ways that I'm going to talk about with Pavlos is we can be kind to local shelters, local animal shelters. Can you think of ways so that, you know, how that helps? That helps all the local animals and helps have people get work. They can go and work for shelters if they're if the shelters have support and it helps animals, helps everyone. So can you think of ways that you and Pavlos have helped local animal shelters? By giving them money. Oh, sorry. Let me get the mic to you. By giving them money and um, the roof roof was my elf pet. <laughs> yes. And that roof roof that Angela did was her and elf dog. pet. And it's a my dog. My brother has a reindeer. Yes. So, so Angela and Pavlos, Angela and Pavlos, they when they do shows, they get money for giving, saving, spending, and investing. Once they save up enough, we go up to an animal shelter. They put the giving money in the till to help the animals get food and help them get people there to care for the animals. And another way that she helps local animals, isn't there something named sugar, Ange? What sugar? Oh, yeah, we're adopting Sugar because she um had a little surgery. Yes, and, and can you tell everybody what Sugar Gunst. is? She's a seal, and Gunst is a turtle. Pavlos adopts Gunst, and I adopted um Sugar, and most of my cousins wanted to adopt Sugar, too. Yes, so we have a baby seal in our house, right, Ant? No. No, we Pavlos had. Pavlos is a stuffed animal, and <laughs> Pavlos has a stuffed animal of guns. And one more thing. So, we actually have a real dog in our house and a real reindeer in our house right now, spying <laughs> on us. Yeah, no. So, the point I wanted to make by saying that is that they adopted it, but they left it in the care of the people who could really help the animals. So, one way to be kind to your community is to help people help other people or help people help animals, right? Yeah. Another way to be kind in your community. How simple is this? And do you want to hear a real simple one? one Go ahead. Tell them one more thing. And um, our nanny adopted one. Well, we adopted another turtle, but I forget its name. Yes. And that, and that turtle when has. We were like th- when I was three, Pavlos was a few years older, was two two years older. And then when my cousin was three, two, and then um when. Um, Jake and Max, um, were a few years older. Yeah. And they, so they adopt, they go down to the animal, um, what is it? The, it's the aquarium or something, right? Yeah. Yeah. So the aquarium. It's more like, um, this thing that, um, has only, um, seals and turtles in it. It has like stuffed animals and like some toys to play with and like you have and this is my favorite thing to use. So um you so it like has this like little map and and then um you have to find the thing in once in one of it it had a sand dollar but we never found the sand dollar. That's the hardest. <laughs> yes. Okay. So Pavlos just got back. And Pavlos, we talked about how you can be kind in your community by helping other people help animals or things like that so we talked about how you guys save up your giving money and bring it to the animals and also adopt an animal but when we adopt an animal we don't bring gunst home did we no no we left it in the care of the people who could help him most right yeah yes so another way let's talk about the real simplest way to be kind to community and you know how simple it is ready i think sugar angela's seal that she adopted already got released yeah that's Gunst pretty had cool. Three surgeries. Yeah, Pavlos's turtle Gunst has had three surgeries, and Just I think like he's still me. in the care. Yes, Pavlos has had surgeries too. So the uh, all right, let's move on to the next way wait, to be. Wait, wait. So in the Mario game, I have the ones that I told you, and then here's all the ones, the power up avail uh, things. Um, red shell, green shell, octopus squiddy thing, a power, and then coins. Okay, and my favorite guy is Yoshi. His power is if you land on star, collect all coins on the board. And if you get um, one of the dices, if you get green shell, you go, choose the next player in front or behind you to drop three coins. 
Okay, one more thing. These are Peach's powers. First star. Collect rent from the bank for each property you own in the red shell. Power up boost. <clears throat> Choose any player to drop four coins. All right. Clearly, they like okay, the Mario no, game. No, no, we, uh, guys, we gotta. We, we're Donkey already. Kongs. We're all, oh, you want to do Donkey Kong's? Okay. Go Donkey ahead. Kong. Steal three coins from each player. Power up boost. The, all other players drop two coins. Okay, so those are the powers that each of the players has in the in the game that they in the in the game. So before we're done, we're gonna say two other ways, and these are real. These are real two. But we lost him. We're two ways to be kind to our community. Number one is simple: just go and play with your neighbors, make friends, and play because that brings a big sense of community and gets people to know each other and gets people to help each other. And one of the coolest part of a community, and really what makes a community, is when people are connected to each other right Ange? yes and one more thing about the mario game mario superstar ability roll the number die collect that many coins plus five from the bank power up boost collect four coins from the bank so um the star is the super star ability and the coins are the power up boost. Yes. Okay. So we got one more way to be kind to a community. This is another simple one. So the first one is to give back and to help people help animals or help people help other people Number in your local area. Number two is to get to know your neighbors, to play with them, to have fun, and to play three games. And number three. Pick up litter. Yes. Pavlos. Great. Number and three. Number three is eat. Eat. Well, well, actually, Ange brings up a good point, because if you eat at local restaurants, you're helping local people with their jobs, keep their jobs and helping local local businesses. So that really is a number four way to help your community. But Pavlos is number three is when you're in your community, be respectful. So pick up your litter. If you're playing at a park, be nice to it. If you see something that's out of place, you can help put it back. And that helps keep your community clean and safe for everybody. All right, guys. Don't forget to head on over to 5minuteswithdad.com slash Mario. We're done with this episode, Ange. So, Pavlos, do you want to tell everybody thank you for listening to 5 Minutes with Dad? Thank you for listening to 5 Minutes with Dad! Bye, 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 bye. Oh, wait. Thank you for yeah, listening. Yeah, bye, 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 bye. Thank you for listening to 5 Minutes with Dad. With Dad.com. <laughs> also, if you want to get the thing, go to 5 Minutes with Dad slash Mario. Bye-bye. Thank you for listening to 5 Minutes with Dad. To connect with Pavlos, Angela, and Nick, subscribe to the 5 Minutes with Dad newsletter at 5minuteswithdad.com. <laughs>